The Gate City Grays kicking off their 10th anniversary season tonight at Hiram, gearing up for their home opener on Saturday night against the Smithfield Blue Sox. The Grays hoping their mix of returners with new young talent can lead to a Northern Utah League championship. I don't want to go too far, right, because we haven't even played a game yet, but we got a special group this year, so we're excited. The last two years have been a blast. Best season I've had by far. And just hanging out with these guys, getting to be able to come back with them, it's great. Shell is back for his third year with the club, but there's some newcomers too, like recent Blackfoot grad Ryan Reynolds. Following an LDS mission in New York City, he's headed to continue his career at Salt Lake Community College and hoping playing with the Grays helps him out. Just hope to get a ton of reps in, just kind of mess around, have some fun, but also try and tune in some pitches, work on some change-ups, whatever it is, just get a lot of good reps in. Pitching hasn't been a problem for the Grays, leading them to a solid 19-6 and record last year, but it's the hitting that Pope says has held them back at times. Last year and the year before it kind of faltered a little bit, um, and I think this year we're, we're going to kind of fix that and, and be able to score some more runs when it counts. Um, and then our pitching. I mean, our pitching the last three or two years has been great, and uh, we brought a lot of those same guys back. Pitching, pitching looks great right now. We're going to go out and dominate and hitting. We're, we're smashing the baseball right now. We're getting the rust off, and we're going to come out hot. The squad is anticipating a packed crowd at Hallowell Park for their home opener. I think some of them don't realize kind of how how much the city of Pocatello loves us and how much you guys support us. So it's going to be it's going to be a great surprise for our guys. I don't know how the crowd's going to be. Um, he said there'd be a lot of people there, so that'll be exciting. But hoping I can just go out and do a good job. The Hornets walk it off in Hiram tonight to take the win. So you can cheer on the Grays as they look for their first victory this year at Hallowell Park on Saturday night at 6 and 8 p.m.